Hello, my name is Mark Cosgrove. I was admitted as a solicitor in 1994. I have over 20 years experience. I have been working for several years with Neglect Assist. My work is primarily professional negligence claims. Our clients were retired. Uh, they own two commercial properties. They decided to sell their two commercial properties and seek advice on what to do with the money. They were contacted by a financial advisor that had previously had a loose connection with their accountants. The financial advisor appeared to be credible, gave them a recommendation that sounded attractive. What he'd actually recommended was an unregulated collective investment scheme. It's basically an investment that lacks the protection that you would get normally um, if you buy an authorised investment. The recommendation actually put our clients £100,000 that they invested into severe financial risk. Uh, they basically stood to lose all of it. In the short term, that investment performed adequately for the first six to 12 months. And based on a further recommendation from the advisor, they were encouraged to put another £50,000 in, which they put into their, directly into their pension. 10 months later, unfortunately, the whole lot collapsed like a pack of cards. They'd invested in the Brandale Property Fund, which was an esoteric, unregulated investment. Uh, it was an entirely inappropriate investment. It should never have been recommended to them in the first place. They basically lost all of their money, all their financial security that they'd worked for for their whole lives. I got to know the clients, got to understand the nature of the case. Uh, we then applied for the documents from the advisor firm. They were obliged to supply them. It became fairly clear from the outset that the advisor had wanted to sell this investment to them for whatever reason, probably financial for himself. What we then did is prepared a detailed letter of claim which was put to the financial advisors going through the appropriate regulations and explaining exactly why it was unsuitable. Uh, once we'd done that, in this case, we had a denial of liability from the financial advisors and we issued court proceedings. They were not going to successfully defend any, any claim bought. We negotiated a settlement at that point and our clients uh, secured the return of pretty much all of the money that they put into the investment. They were looking for something safe and secure. They were sold something that was the, the entire opposite. And through the work that we did for them, they now have a safe and secure financial retirement moving forward and they were very happy with the outcome. With our experience in this area of work, we can help clients guide them through it and make it as straightforward a process as possible to secure the best settlement we can in the shortest possible time. Neglect Assist have experience over many years. We pool and share knowledge on cases and we generally find that because of the shared knowledge in the department that we can move forward with cases progressively, swiftly to secure the best result for our clients.